I've been messing about again. Can't help myself. I've got another ERA Morty Slug. I have picked this one a few times. It's not an hard lot to pick. But it's all intact, then there is anti-pick notches in there, and that's the bit in under key. So, what's this you may think? Now, this is out of a ring binder folder. You've probably seen them. It sits in the bottom of the folder, and there's like a little lever there, and it drops down, and you put your A4 sheets of paper with two holes over there, and that's it. So I've took that out of the folder. I've not done anything to it. That's exactly as it comes. And I'm going to actually tension this lock using that. And it's perfect because if you put, let me just first of all turn the curtain. It's easier to turn the curtain with the wire. You put that hook in and then just turn it round. The hook will catch the bolt. So obviously people might say, oh, you couldn't do that in a door. Well, you could because you could actually bend this and shape it to how you wanted it. But all I'm using is the actual natural bend of the hook to tension the bolt. So... It's a bit of fun, and I know a lot of people don't like these type of videos. Now people say, oh, well, what are you doing that for? But I'm just showing you different ways of tensioning the bolt. If you ever got locked out and you didn't have a tension tool, then I'm sure most people's got these folders lying around the house. You could tension your lock. You can hear this, the levers dropping back down when I let the tension off, so it's tensioning it fine. And as I say, you could tension your lock using that little mechanism out of the folder. And there you go. It does work. Obviously, it won't turn around now because it's catching on there. But like I say, if you bent that, you'd obviously be able to use it and completely throw it. But no, it works. And like I say... It's just a normal pick wire and that little bit of metal out of a ring folder. Simple as that. I just want to show you, I'm only going to get all the levers out. Everybody's seen this lock. I've probably picked this lock on about five different videos. It's probably one of my go-to locks because it's easy to pick. And when I make a simple contraption, I always use this lock as an experiment. Yeah, okay, it probably wouldn't pick, you know, a top quality lock, but... It's the same principle as any tension tool. All you're doing is tensioning that cam onto the bolt. And it's down to your picking skills, whether you could get the locks open or not. I use this lock just for speed. Like I say, I know this lock, it's not hard to pick. And it's purely a speed thing for me video. But as you can see, it's all intact. It's all there. All the levers are there. All got anti-pick notches in. And I've picked that open using that, which is out of a ring binder folder. So that's something else for you to have a play about with. And that's it for now. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Try a bit.